Well, it's Shannon. So I'm coming at you with a haul from SR Harris Fabrics outside of the cities. The Twin Cities, which is Minneapolis, St. Paul. I believe I picked this up at the Brooklyn Park location. And then I picked some up at the Burnsville location. So, yeah. I bought a fabric. Actually, maybe not a lot, but I got a pretty good deal on it. Um, so the Brooklyn Park one is really interesting because you cut it yourself. And the Burnsville one is full service. And I did pick stuff, some stuff off remnants, but I don't remember exactly what. Um, I do really wish the uh, Burnsville one, I, because like the Brooklyn Park one, I, think it's, I can't remember which one's which, sorry. Uh, one's 30,000 square foot, one's 15,000 square foot. They're, it, they're, it's an outlet, or they are outlets. Uh, they have some really good deals. I'm pretty sure I picked some of the stuff up off the remnants section, and the remnants are generally like five bucks a piece. Uh, not a piece, but a yard. So I picked up this beautiful, like dark blue heathered sweatshirt, sweatpant material to, well, make sweatpants. <laughs> um, it's fairly thick. It's definitely, I would call it like more of a, a sweater, sweater weight material. It's really hard to judge a lot of this stuff when you look online, I find, too. I haven't really ordered a lot online. I just ordered for the first time from Girl Charlie because they had a heck of a sale around President's Day. It might have been before or after that, but I mean, it was a heck of a Like, I picked stuff up for under $2 here. I picked up a bunch of stuff there. Um, so, yeah. And then I picked up this. I definitely got off the remnants. I forget how much this is, but it's really beautiful. It's like a purple I don't know if it's like a purple twill but it kind of reminds me of like if it were a purple denim uh, I've never really seen a purple denim but it's kind of a grape it's really a nice color a lot of the stuff I wear it would go really well with it has a slight an ever so slight amount of stretch not a lot at all but there's definitely enough there if I remember correctly I think this was like three or three and a half yards which and the remnants are five bucks a yard, so it'd be about fifteen dollars, so pretty cheap pants to make. And then I picked up a lot of t-shirt material, which is not unusual because I love to make t-shirts, so sorry dude. Seriously, this does not have, I, I just wish they had more information. I believe, see this is why I should write it down on this receipt immediately after I buy it when I remember what stuff is. I believe this is wool. A wool knit. I think this is a wool knit. I think I picked up a yard and a half if I recall correctly. Uh, I've picked up wool knits from there before. FYI, I went last week and they had silk knit. I really kind of wish they would sell online and ship. I understand why they don't just because it's ever changing, but if I go, when I go back in the next couple months, if they have any silk knit left, I will probably pick some up. It was like around 10 bucks a yard, which I thought was pretty good from what I've seen for silk knit. A lot of times it's 20. So they had it marked down to 10. I also picked up, this is like, seriously, I love this color. Uh, I love a good jewel tone green, like a good forest green. And I picked up, God only knows, it looks like a lot of yards of this. Oh, no, I picked, I wonder if these, these may be remnants. Uh, I picked up this and this. I don't know if this is wool knit or not. Again, this is a problem when it doesn't really say what it is. It just says four, three piece, two and a half, three and a half, two pieces, two and three fourths. I have no freaking idea. <laughs> I'm like, I might have picked up a poop ton of remnants. Uh, this is definitely just your regular old knit t shirt material. It's a nice royal blue. And then I love this magenta color. I have a lot of shirts in, in both these colors. I will have a lot of shirts in this color because I love this. Um, I think this is a, I don't know that this is a wool knit. I think this is t-shirt. Um, but this is definitely t-shirt, yeah, and or knit, whatever you want to call it. But I call it t-shirt, t-shirt knit. I don't know, because to me that's basically like super soft knit with like a, like a, like a lycra in it or whatever, I don't know. 
it's just great. I'm very specific and kind of picky, quite frankly, with my t-shirt material, which is, again, another reason I've never really ordered it online because I really like the Eddie Bauer long sleeve shirts. Uh, I like their t-shirts, too. Uh, actually, I just like Eddie Bauer, like, lounge wear, athleisure, whatever you want to call it in general because it looks really nice when you wear it. It's presentable, <laughs> casual, but not, like, you know, too casual. Anyways. I love the feel of the material and these remind me a lot of that Eddie Bauer like it's I believe theirs is a cotton modal or cotton lycra so anyways uh so this is the stuff I picked up Whoo, Lord, from I'm guessing Brooklyn Park I'm guessing Brooklyn Park um so this is one and a half yards of knit fabric um, another one and a half yards of, I told you, I told you I like these colors, one and a half yards of knit fabric, um, another yard and a half of knit fabric, because I feel like a yard and a half I can make anything I want, pretty much, um, I picked up three yards of this knit, because I'm freaking obsessed, oh, I think these are, a couple of different trips. Sorry, y'all, if, if that's the way it turns out, because it looks like it might be. Uh, I picked up one and a half yards of this knit, uh, another one and a half of this one, and then I picked up three yards of this beautiful flannel and another three yards of this flannel, and it was half off plus an extra, like, no, it was... This one was 60% off. Everything at uh, SR Harris Fabric is half off of whatever it's labeled at. And they have some absolutely beautiful stuff. Like, I recently went, and in my next haul, you'll see, I picked up some sequin stuff. So I was super excited about it. Um, but yeah, I thought I had picked up some wool. I must, the wool must be in the other one because I don't usually see it at the one location. Usually I only see it at the, the big location, but I must have picked it up at the other one instead because uh, usually I have that label pretty well. So that is all for this haul. It's going to be a short one. But don't worry, there are other ones coming up here really soon because I have more to haul. I just try and do them in separate like chunks, if that makes sense. So um, I'm really excited. I just like to, like, honestly make t-shirts are just easy for me to do for the most part. And I'm still learning, so I think it's a good thing to practice. I really like it. Uh, worst case scenario, I screwed up and I wear it as a pajama or a gym shirt, whatever. So, um, I really dig it. I've really been digging the feel of those wool knits that I've been picking up. And, uh, they're wonderful. They're warm. They're, like, really great. Um, just general, like, shirt material. And I kind of wished I had picked up that silk one. Uh, when I saw it last week, but I'm going back. So hopefully it will be there. Fingers crossed. It'll still, they'll, they'll have some, they might get more in, you know? So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any suggestions, ideas, things, you know, you, you want to see, let me know in the comment section below and I will talk to you guys later. I hope you have a wonderful evening, morning, afternoon, whatever it is, or wherever you are. I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.